Okay, now we're going to actually cover a Pixie Boot or PXE Boot, as some people may refer to it, as far as a uh, configuration that you need to change inside of Thin Manager if you want to be able to boot third party pieces of hardware uh, as opposed to ACP enabled pieces of hardware inside of Thin Manager 5.0. This is something new to Thin Manager 5.0, and one of the things you would need to do is you basically come up here to Manage, and you're going to click on the PXE Server. Uh, area here. And then the next thing you want to do is we actually want to enable the Pixie, Pixie server. And once we do that, we're going to click on next. It's going to give us a few of, uh, different options that we have on our Pixie server mode. We can be able to use a standard DHCV server, or we can use a standard DHCV server with boot options such as 66 and 67, or we can say it's not using a standard DHCV server. Um, and those are three different options that are available for you there. If you've got questions on which one you need to apply, I'd encourage you to actually look at our thin manual for th uh, thin manager 5.0 or look at the actual full blown user's guide. Either one will have the details for you there. We also want to be able to allow new PXE clients to be able to boot. And then once we do that, we click on next. We're going to actually add an IP address scheme if needed. And for this, I've got a basically from dot 70 to dot 75 already applied. Then we're going to click on finish and then it's going to actually set up the PXE server to be configured configured in our environment for Thin Manager. Once again, if you've got more questions on that and you've got a question regarding the hardware that's uh, compatible with Thin Manager 5.0, I would encourage you to check out our webpage for the compatibility list and the information there. That list is changing day in and day out with other pieces of hardware that are being added as we go along. So check that out on our website at thinmanager.com.